Good morning and welcome to the day in the life of a Minerva student in Taipei. I'm Andy and I'm part of the class of 2025 and today I'm going to show you what I do on like a daily basis in Taipei in my second year at Minerva. After my morning class, I like to head out and grab some local breakfast. I usually go to a nearby bakery or a store and then I stop by at a cafe to study. Our residence hall has a built-in cafe and they have promotional prices for Minerva students so that is always convenient if I don't feel like going too far to study, grab a cup of coffee and to go through my notes for the next class. Although it's really nice to study in the same place as a lot of my classmates, I try to take a break from studying around midday and walk around the city a little bit. This is the time when I get to explore Taipei a little bit, grab a local lunch like beef noodles right here, and walk around in parks or souvenir stores or anything that I feel like at that time of the day. In the afternoons I also have classes again and sometimes I schedule in calls with different projects as well. This semester I am taking two business courses and an arts and humanities course which I'm actually really enjoying even though I don't intend to major in it and this is one of my favorite parts about the Minerva curriculum as I get to explore different areas of subjects and topics that I wouldn't normally study if I had a narrow degree. In this video you can see me talking to my civic partner in Taipei as we are working on a branding project to advertise and gain international exposure to a city that hasn't gotten so much attention so far. At the end of every busy day I like to visit this nighttime breakfast place that serves local food. It has gradually become a hub for our class and my personal favorite is the scallion pancake with egg and cheese that I get almost every day. Although the restaurant has a seating area, I decided to head back to my room to eat my dinner as I was getting ready for a 10 one. I stopped on the way at one of the many stores filled with claw machines to see if I could win a pair of headphones, but unfortunately luck was not on my side that day. After grabbing food, I rushed down to the common room for the Austrian 10 one a Minerva event where our classmates from Austria taught us about their country and culture, then showed everyone how to dance waltz. Although this may look very chaotic and crowded, everyone loves it when our whole class can come together to learn about each other and have fun. Some people ended up leaving with better polished dance skills than others, but we all certainly had a nice ending. 